Hey Aries, this is Hale for ATS Ultimage. Congratulations! You have the chance to win a free mini monthly this month. So here's how it works. I'm going to describe it to you. It's very simple. Alright, so I'm going to give you a random, silly, totally non-book smart, no way to study for it question, <laughs> and you just take a random guess at it through the comments, you know, the YouTube comments. And that is your entry to win the reading. Alright, so here's how it works. Only one person can win the mini monthly. So it's whoever guesses the correct answer first wins. And that's the other thing. You cannot guess the same thing somebody else guessed. So I mean, you know, sometimes people pay attention to this and sometimes they don't. So... Putting that forward, so that means you have one guess, one single guess, you can only guess one thing, that keeps you valid for this competition to get the free mini monthly. And it's recorded, I send it off to you via email whenever it's time to bring it out. Um, I'm usually pretty quick with it though. Um, and yeah, and you get a free mini monthly, so it's pretty sweet. Okay, so here is the really, really, really random one I'm going to have for you. I have many different pairs of colored denim, okay? And there is one particular pair. You know what? I'm going to give you two, all right? Okay, I'm going to give you two. So if somebody is lucky enough to guess both, like, one color and then somebody else guesses the other color, you're A-OK. -okay. You can both win, all right? Because I have two colors of denim that are completely unusual, and really not mass produced, and really nobody makes colored denim now because the trend is over, so it's like the fashion industry isn't producing as much. They still do a few, but not as many as they used to. Two highly unusual colors of denim, you know, pants, jeans, okay? They're highly unusual, so it's a very particular shade. They're fashion colors, so I want for you to guess along those lines. I don't think I should really give you any more than that. So there is your question. Guess for me the color, the unusual color denim that I own, all right? And if you you get one of two, like there are two that I'm going to allow, okay? There are two highly unusual colors I own. So if somebody guesses the one color and somebody guesses the other, you both win, okay? And this is valid throughout the whole month. You know, it's the whole month of October and once I post it. And honestly, the last time, somebody guessed within, like, a few hours of the video being up, okay? So I would say just take a shot at it. And remember, they're fashion colors. That's my hint to you, okay? So think unique fashion colors that are definitely fashion or, or very specific colors, alright guys? Best of luck to you, and I'm really looking forward to this. I loved giving away these readings last time, and I'm, I'm sure I'll love doing it again, all right? Okay, so best of luck to you, and enjoy your reading. Hey, everybody. Before we begin, I just want to make an amendment to the announcement that you're going to see after this part of the video. Um, in the next part of the video, I'm going to give people details if they would like to provide... Um, a potential segment for video testimonials through my website. I'm giving the update that if you do so, it will not be viewable on YouTube. That means the only way anybody can see your testimonial is if they go directly to my website and they click on the video of, you know, whatever testimonial, real testimonials, etc. So if you want to provide a video testimonial, um, and I give the details in the following video about how you would go about doing that, um, then remember, it will not be viewable on YouTube by anybody. It's going to be a private video, so no one can even see it in the listing. And it will only be viewable through my website if people go to my website, click on the video, and view the testimonial. So basically, if nobody goes to my website, um, or, you know, whoever doesn't go to my website isn't going to see you on the video. It's only people who actually go to the website and click on the video. All right, that said, um, I have updates for you coming up, and I will see you later. Hey guys, this is Hale for HES Ultimage, and this is just a little intro with some updates for you since um, I'm kind of trying to add a little bit more to the channel and switch it up a little bit. Um, so I'm just going to try and, you know, be spontaneous and describe 
all various things that I'm kind of coming through with. Okay, so, first one is, from now on, <laughs> I'm trying to do a little thing that for me was fun and um, I think it wound up being fun for everybody else too. I'm going to start offering one free mini monthly every month, okay? Um, so here's how that's gonna work and I'll tell you how the idea originated. Um, I got food caught in my teeth during the Leo video and it was right in the middle of the message so I couldn't edit it out. Um, so I did a little guessing game with them for them to win the free mini monthly to guess what I ate for dinner that night. And, um, it worked out and somebody got it and they got their free mini monthly and, you know, it, it drove a little bit of participation and at the same time it's like the opportunity for me to give back to by giving a free, uh, little reading like that. Um, so here's how it's gonna work. Leo's already had the opportunity, so from now on it'll just be one sign every month will get that opportunity to get the free mini monthly and it'll be some dumb question I'll ask or something really trivial. It's not like something that you can study for, you know? It'll just be some random question maybe about like just stuff about me or whatever. Like something simple that nobody could really know. So that way it's like perfectly um, fair that everybody just has this random silly guess and then you might just win the free mini monthly. Um, it can only be given to one person. So, because otherwise then if I'm doing like tw 12 like free mini monthlies, it's going to kill me. <laughs> and you guys already know how like I've had to watch over exerting myself before. Um, so it can only go to one person. So you leave your answer in the comment section. And, um, that will be, you know, your answer is, like, locked in, and then I'll send you, like, a private message if you want. But also, like, put in the comment section that you want as well. So it's, like, whoever answers it first is the one who gets the free mini monthly. So if you answer afterwards, it doesn't count anymore, guys. I mean, it, that makes some sense. But, but yeah, I just wanted to cover that. I'm excited to do it. I thought it was a lot of fun to do it, and I mean, I like to be able to do, you know, that little something extra. It made me feel good, too, to be able to do it, because I was like, rather than getting everybody yelling at me about having food caught in my teeth, I'll just, like, preempt it and make it into something positive instead of into something negative, all right? So, um, that said, I really enjoyed doing it, so I'm going to keep doing it, all right? So it just means that one person every month um, out of the viewers who choose to participate in that little guessing game. Again, it's only going to be one side a month, guys. So you can either look for it, because you can look for it. I'll do it at the beginning of the video unless I do one of these little update things first, in which case I know it comes second, or, or I'll just put it in the beginning so that way, you know, it's not as much to have to sift through. But So that means, you know, if it's Leo one month, it won't be Leo again for another year, okay? Like, I'm gonna try and rotate them, but I'll probably try and stagger them around and switch it up so, you know, so that way I keep it like a surprise, okay? Instead of making it too systematic. But I wanted to clarify that it's not gonna be in Leo for two months in a row or twice in a year, okay? So for those who enjoyed the Leo one and, you know, got to have a chance at that, now it's gonna be in the other videos, okay? Again, the only way you're gonna know it is by seeing the intro where I go, Hey guys, you got a chance to win a free mini monthly. Here's the stupid question. <laughs> I'm sorry to keep calling it a stupid question, but I want to clarify. This isn't about book smarts. This isn't about, you know, who can look things up on my Facebook. You know, it's just a random thing that you just guess and maybe you'll win. It's that idea. All right. But, um, yeah, and that one's a recorded reading, so I just send it through the email, but hey, it's a free reading. Awesome. All right, so, that said, moving on to some other stuff, um, I had an idea, and I'm going to put it through to you guys, and I may or may not execute this idea, I'm going to see what the response is like and what comes through, and from there I'll make my decision. So here's the thing. Everybody who's seen my website knows that I don't have any testimonials. This is the reason. 
It's because I always believed that I did not like written testimonials at all because anybody can write a written testimonial. So it's like, I could have written them all. How would you know the difference? And I'm like, screw that. I mean, as much as it's nice to see a written testimonial and go, well, you know, that's, you know, whatever, it's great. But at the end of the day, how do you really know that was real? Um, so this was what I was thinking, and we'll see how this goes or if it winds up materializing. So hear me out. Um, for those of you who have gotten readings from me before, um, here is how I got this idea. There was actually the winner of um, the prior month's Mini Monthly, was so nice and she actually sent me a little like two minute video um response uh to her reading and it was just shot off her cell phone and it was really great and it was just like really nice to put a face to it and like see that you know it made a difference for her and she felt really good about it and that's what i was thinking would be really great for the testimonials if i did them so here's my idea all right so if you've had a reading from me before um, and would like to provide a testimonial, here is how I would like to do it. If you could take like a one, two minute video off of your cell phone, so really low um, budget, you know, no, no high production value here, just like a simple no frills video, just saying, you know, um, how you felt about your eating, you know, what makes my particular style appealing to you compared to others, or, you know, how it came through for you, and all of that, then you would send that to me, to my email. If you've had a reading from me before, you probably still have my email. Um, it's just my name at Gmail, just to refresh your memory. Um, you can also send me a contact form through my website saying you'd like to be a part of the testimonial reel, assuming that I put everything through and put it together. Because basically then what I'd like to do ideally is fuse all of those little few minute clips together into one video that I will embed only into my website. Because that's the other thing. Like, I understand that if you put your face to it, then it's not perfectly anonymous, but you don't have to give your name, you don't have to give your country, you can if you feel like it, I mean, um, or you, you know what, actually, I kind of think telling your country might be fun, since I know I get a lot of business from all over the world, and I think it's really cool, personally, and I like knowing that there are people all over the world who, you know, enjoy what I do and benefit from what I do, thankfully, um, so maybe your country would be cool if you go, okay, um, from here, this is, you know, how I got this reading, and I liked it, etc., etc., or, um, you know, he really picked up on these things, and that was pretty cool, etc., like, however you want to put things or word it, I'm, I'm not a stickler with that. But, um, you don't have to give your name, you can if you want, but the idea is, because I really want to make this clear, I don't want the testimonial video to be a part of my regular YouTube, because of the fact that it's not really necessary in that way, your privacy and your um, identity are being, you know, kept more low-key. I understand that as a client, you don't really feel like having people comment on you, and honestly, I can totally understand that. I mean, I signed up for this. I signed up to be at the scrutiny of all people all over the world, and I have experienced things where people will just comment and just be mean or something, and I was like, I want to protect my clients and my fans from that kind of treatment. So if I do that testimonial reel, I'm going to make it, ideally this is how I'd like to do it. Ideally I'd like to make it as a private video and just embed it into my website. So the only people who can watch it are people who are actually coming to my website and looking for a reading, and they can't even comment on it. Or, if I can't do that, then I'll make it a public video that would still be accessible through my um, YouTube channel, but I would disable comments completely. Because it's like, I don't want people to comment on my clients or my fans. That is not a part of this package. So, um, so that said, 
if you would like to provide that one minute, two minute, like just few minute testimonial thing off of like your cell phone. And most cell phones have a camera now that faces you and you can just talk into it. Um, and you, most of them too have a feature where you can literally just forward the video through an email directly to me. Um, or to yourself and then to me. So it's like, I think it's a cool idea. I think it's very unique. I think I've never seen anything like it before where people do video testimonials, which I think is so much more intimate, so much more genuine, so much more me, I think, um, you know, judging by the way I do things. I mean, oh my God, I got this one comment and, and this person who was trying to just kind of like hate her on me was like, sit in a chair, man. It's like, that's not who I am, you know? And I mean, I always want to be true to myself when I do this as much as, you know, true to my identity and what I believe and everything like that. And I would never do testimonials any other way. So, so I mean, if I only got like, you know, a few people, okay, because if my fans or clients just don't happen to know how to use their cell phone cameras or something, some might, some might not, it's not a big deal, then I can always just put this off for another time, but I just think that this would be a really cool idea, and it's the only way I would ever want to do testimonials, so, so if anybody is interested in doing that, you can take that little video of yourself and then send it to me, and then I can, you know, put them together into a video. Ideally, that would be great, but I mean, at the end of the day, I realize that if people don't want people to know that they got a reading from me, that's A-OK -okay too. So I'm cool if it doesn't work out, but, but I just had, like, a vision of, wow, this would be cool, so I'm just putting it out there. I mean, I've survived, you know, a whole year with zero testimonials and get plenty of business, so it's not really necessary, but it's just, like, um... To me, it's like, if I was going to do it, this is how I would, and it would be a nice little addition, so. Alright, so that said, um, thinking if there's anything else that I'm going to kind of go into, um, yeah, I mean, I think I'm pretty good. So, so that said, on to your scheduled programming, and thank you for listening. Hey Aries, this is Hale for HES Ultimage, and this is your channeled Teeley forecast for the month of October. All right, and uh, for personal readings, you can go to hesultimage.com, spelled just like my channel. Um, and this is your teacup for the month. And um, honestly, as much as um, I still do the tea leaves and all, I can pretty much, with the tea leaf readings, it's getting to be more like a straight channeled reading at this point. I only get a few um, symbols there, and it's like, some I can even just pick up from the cup, like, it's just, now it's becoming a little more superfluous to really need it. Um, but I still like to show it for now, but honestly, maybe later I, I won't even bother, because it's just not really that necessary anymore. Um, and yeah, that's the other thing. Um, I'm just gonna go on saying channel tea leaf or, um, tarot reading, because I know now that I channel for my higher self, um, and... You know, uh, for those of you who have followed me from the beginning, it was divination forecast before I could channel and before I went through my spiritual ascension. Um, then it became spirit tarot tea leaf forecast when I learned how to do that. And I evolve with this channel, um, just like all people grow and evolve. And, um, and now I understand that I channel for my higher self. And higher self forecast just sounds strange. So, um, so I'm just going to call it channeled tea leaf or tarot forecast and keep it at that. But, um, that said, I'm going to get into your October. Okay. All right. So first one I'm getting for Aries October is Mars energy. Um, in this case, it has to do with like taking action, taking concrete steps, having a more offense perspective when it comes to the month. That means that you need to, um, Okay, yeah. Um, that means that you need to um, be more proactive, okay? Uh, you know, you're not going to be just reacting to things happening to you. It's about getting things done and making things happen for yourself, okay? Okay, so um, I'm just going to elaborate now a little bit on um, what you know, different things that you might 
you know, uh, get this energy through, but the idea is, um, so if there are certain projects that you're waiting to work on, start working on them now. If, um, you are thinking of becoming more social or getting more involved in the dating scene or other things like that, now would be a good time to do that as well. The idea is you don't need to be waiting this month to have things happen to you. Um, this month you want to be the one making things happen, okay? And that really is the fundamental, and the tea leaf ones are being very, very simplified for this month, because that's just what is required. Um, but really, it is that simple for you guys. Like, the idea is for Aries for this month, just be the one to, to you know, put the ball into play, to, um, to be the one who takes control of the situation, or um, who takes control of the scenario or opportunity by participating. All right, because participation is key, really, with this. And um, I would say, in your case, it could be, yeah, all different areas of life. But um, but I would really say for, for this month, it's really, you don't want to wait for other things to have to happen to you and then react to them again. It's really about you taking the initiative. All right? All right, so... um. So that said, again, if you have any kind of things where um, where you've been considering, you know, taking steps and haven't yet, then I would suggest this month taking greater action upon them. So um, really, I would say just about in any area of life, get the ball rolling. All right? All right. Okay. So that said, um, I do personal readings. If you want one, hit the link below. Um, or go to hesultimage.com, spelled like the channel, and um, I wish you a very active month. I'll see you later.